Mr. John Conklin. I am the uh, wider director of the school. Sorry, I lost my voice trying to wrangle 110 kids trying to get ourselves ready this evening. If you could, though, please take a quick moment to silence all noise-making devices. Tonight's performance is already being professionally recorded by our friends at Wake Cross Media. They will be posting it on YouTube, usually within the next 24 hours, so you'll have a chance to relive the wonderful sounds in here at this concert, probably as early as tomorrow afternoon. Concert tonight should run about 45 minutes. Um, if you'd like to follow along our programs, we have them at the door as you're coming in. Hopefully you have that, and we'll see what's coming next, which groups are performing next. We're really excited. Tonight's concert is really about a celebration of all of our students' hard work over this first semester. For our exploratory group, which you'll hear second, this group, this is their first actual time performing as a choir. Earlier this year, they attended a high school event to try and get their feet wet. It's like, oh, this is what a concert should be like. But now they're actually have a chance to get on the stage themselves. And the group behind me, though, that we're going to talk about, this is our seventh grade full year chorus. This group meets with me every day, fifth out, and we are preparing two solo songs for your view this evening. The first one is Sing Hey. Thank you. 
your course, brand new courses here, where students have the opportunity to try choir out for a semester rather than committing to the full year. This group has had a lot of fun. This is actually four different class, uh, class periods up on the stage right now that get to if only a chance to sit together one time as we brought in the final speak here. Um, but this group is trying to get a full spectrum of the kind of songs that we sing in class. We're going to start things off with a little fanfare for this winter season called Sing Out the Season.
pop music that people do arrange for choir. This next selection was made famous by Bruno Mars. It's called Count on Me. It needs no other introduction than that. Strauss. Uh, 
And then finally, uh, the last piece here is uh, Tchaikovsky's 1812 Overture. Uh, we had a lot of fun talking not only about this piece and learning good choral technique and singing, but also mixing in some of these traditional classical symphonic pieces. So we'll end this portion um, of the exploratory course with this various themes on follow up.
Thank you, Lord. Thank you for being so supportive. It takes a lot of guts to get up in front of this wonderful audience, but also in front of over a hundred of your peers to be able to sing like that. So congratulations, Rosie. Thank you very much. And at this time.
adjustments in our district as far as scheduling goes. And we, um, we had a pretty small number on our courses. We ended up having only around 50 students who were able to take the course after we had everything set up in the schedule. Um, this year, okay, including my next semester group, we have over 180 students who are going to be taking course this year. So we have more than tripled in size, and it is just such a blessing to work with this many students on a daily basis. So thank you, parents and families in our community, for supporting this program and what we do. Tonight, we wanted to send everyone off with a bit of holiday cheer. We're going to be singing a combined number, which is actually not two songs, Let It Snow and Winter Wonderland. At the conclusion of this piece, we will dismiss all of your students directly to you. Some of them have items uh, locked over here, so they need to grab them. But once I dismiss them by row, they are free to come with you once the concert is complete. So without further ado, thank you again so much. This is Let It Snow and Winter Wonderland. 